Hi guys, it's Fia. Your Christmas shopping list won't be complete without checking out what Nintendo's got lined up. So here are the 14 upcoming Switch games for December 2018 arranged by release dates. Monster Boy and the Cursed Kingdom For Game Atelier's platformer, the legend has only just begun. Making a switch from motion-based animation to a friendlier hand-drawn art style was probably the best choice for the series. If you're a fan of Lizard Cube's platform action adventure Wonder Boy, then this is right up your alley. Made under the keen eye of Wonder Boy creator Nishizawa, it occupies that same boy adventure trope. Take on the shoes of the brave protagonist as he fights against fantastic creatures with his powers of transformation. Cursed as the eponymous kingdom is, the game is decidedly vibrant, especially in full HD. It's set to release this December 4th. Atelier Arlen series Deluxe Pack There's plenty of magic to go around in this back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back package of the beloved Arlen series. Already released in Japan, it's about time the Deluxe Alchemical Edition makes it to Western shores. This will include the three remastered titles of the series, namely the adventures of Atelier's Verona, Totori, and Meruru. This Deluxe Pack will also include a bunch of its previously released DLCs. Buy all three and you get all its turn-based battles, visual style storytelling, and alchemy for a discounted price. A comprehensive digital-only package for RPG fans, it's set to release on December 4th. <laughs> Gear Club Unlimited 2 Coming in at almost the same time as its debut last year, Gear Club is gearing up for what seems to be another Switch exclusive release. Getting a provisional play score of 6.68 with last year's premiere, it's safe to say that the series has a lot of room for improvement. This sequel aims to deliver, with more than 1800 miles of roads to drive across using their array of realistically rendered cars. From snowy mountaintops to sandy deserts, there's definitely more to see. Criticized for overly simplifying the racing genre, Gear Club Unlimited 2 will hopefully need a bit more elbow grease. It's set to release on December 4th. Next up, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Going straight to the numbers, this most anticipated title will have a grand total of 74 playable characters and up to 103 stages to play in. That's all your favorite characters from the N64 days up to the 3DS, with newbies like Inkling, Ridley, Simon, King K. Roo, Isabelle, and the adorably feisty Incineroar. Also included are new Echo Fighters in Daisy, Dark Samus, Chrom, Richter, and Ken. More on top of that, there's the game-changing spirits which are supporting characters from other games that come to give useful upgrades to your chosen fighter's abilities. But wait, there is more! There's also going to be new brawling mechanics, gameplay modes like Squad, Strike, Tourney, and Smashdown, as well as an overhaul of online matchmaking that pairs you with like-minded smashers. The Smash Bros games and all Smash Bros games, it's coming out on December 7th. Katamari Damacy Reroll. Building on their 2004 third person puzzler for the PlayStation 2, the Clump Spirits are taking their cosmic restoration missions to the modern generation. Remade into its now fully HD form, the classic Katamari world looks better than ever before. 
help the pint-sized prince in his quest to restore the cosmos and take on each of their object collecting challenges. With some reviews already coming in, there's been some complaints about the game's fussy controls, something that seems to be a remnant of its last-gen past. We'll have to find out how much the new motion control system will improve the experience. While it might be a little too faithful to the original, its many timeless aspects is enough to warrant a quick look. It's set to release on December 7th. Hello Neighbor, Hide and Seek If you're also wondering how that creepy neighbor in Tiny Build Stealth Horror came to be, then this official sequel will hopefully answer all our questions. In Hello Neighbor, you play the trespassing neighbor to a paranoid would-be maniac powered by a continually learning AI that adjusts to your moves. As solid a premise as it was, the game received mixed reviews from both gamers and critics. Despite the backlash, developers are soldiering on, hoping to improve with new locations to sneak into in the neighbor's happier past. Opening up with an emotionally charged teaser, it's hard not to have some faith in the project. It's set to release this December 7. Wondering where your console games have gone? You can find all of them in last week's upcoming December games video. Otherwise, you can get some of these games by clicking the links provided in our description box. And if you want to watch me and the What to Play gang play the latest games, you can check out our gameplay channel What to Play Live by clicking the icon in the top right corner. Dragon Marked for Death Developed by the same team that brought us the now classic Mega Man Zero series, Dragon Mark for Death captures the fast-paced side-scrolling battles of its predecessor and paired it with multiplayer-focused challenges perfect for the Switch. Players get to choose between four different characters, each with unique sets of skills and attributes, like the tanky warrior, the fast and deceptive shinobi, the fighter support witch, and the balanced fighter princess. Other than a Japanese gameplay and the trailer, we don't have much details about the game. It does promise to deliver a massive role with some form of character customization. Dragon Mark for Death is set to release this 13th of December. Pipe Push Paradise not all plumbing games on the eShop have Mario in it. In Pipe Push Paradise, you are the plumber, on a mission to restore the island's pipes. There is not really a story here, just plain old Sokoban style puzzle with 47 levels you have to solve. The mechanics are almost exactly the same as other logic puzzles, just more difficult. Its PC release earlier this year did not receive that much coverage. What little reviews it has though are mostly praises, citing the game's originality and fair difficulty progression. If this switched version is a direct port of the PC original, we might be in for a puzzle treat. Pipe Push Paradise is releasing this December 20th. Black Sea Odyssey The cosmos are a mysterious and scary place, but we bet you've never imagined it like this. Taking interstellar battles to a whole new level, Black Sea Odyssey is an indie twin-stick shooter with roguelike elements that promises hours of adrenaline-pumping action. Like most shoot-em-ups, it's simple graphics-wise, but it compensates with slick and fast-paced gameplay. Released on the PC in 2016, Black Sea Odyssey has received very positive scores from critics and user reviewers. Now with its Switch port, it'll still be more single-player gaming, but you can sail around the extremely destructible cosmic abyss wherever you go. It's coming out on December 20th, 2018.
Digirati Indie Bundle, Inc., and Hacky Zack. What with the rise of indie games on the Switch, Digirati decides to double up with this brilliant back-to-back -back feature. This indie bundle contains Zackbo Games' colorful platformer Inc., as well as Spaceboy Games' ball-juggling Hacky Zack. Each being successful titles in their own right makes this a budget-friendly bundle. Whether it's testing your skills in the precision platforming Zack or speedrunning through the 75 levels of the world's first platformer, there's something for platform fans to enjoy in each one. Both games are also co-op friendly titles, which let you enjoy the fun with a friend. It's set to release on December 20th. Dynasty Warriors 8 Extreme Legends Definitive Edition Upgrading on an upgrade, Koei Tecmo's 2013 installment of their Hack and Slash series gets a definitive edition four years after the last expansion. It's a new dive into the historic Three Kingdoms of China with this new compilation that includes content from the original as well as the expansion. This means that players will get almost all of the released DLCs, from costumes to side story scenarios. Owners of the recent Warriors Orochi will also get save data bonus costumes. Packing a bunch of DLCs into one title, it'll be like a new fresh experience of their intense tactical battles. It's set to release on December 27th. Carcassonne. From the award-winning board game Carcassonne, this video game adaptation lets you build your own medieval world in full 3D. Just like the board game, enjoy its fun and tactical tile placement gameplay. Players will draw and place tiles, each hoping to own features like roads, castles, and monasteries for points. The game is basically revolved around its very casual but challenging strategic layers. Gather your friends and learn to become the best tactician with up to 4 players in local multiplayer. It comes out this December 2018. Desert Child a chip off the old Kickstarter block, Oscar Bitten's racing RPG has no shortage of style. For starters, the game seems to rock its pixel aesthetics. While it's an art style that's been used and abused by indie developers the world over, it seems to encapsulate the cool, laid-back, and almost hipstery feel of Desert Child. Centered on a not-so-distant future filled with hoverboarding and ramen eating, it's really more than a racing game. Packed with minigames and quirky humor, bump up your racing career by stealing parts, delivering pizzas, and winning races on the side. There have been a few delays, but the game's beta is opening soon. We hope it'll be a full release sometime this December. Last but not the least is Treasure Stack. Jump, grapple, and stack in the single and multiplayer puzzle experience from Pixel Lakes. Mixing block puzzle mechanics and platformer elements, enjoy an adorable 8-bit game that takes you back to the classics with a slight touch of modernity. Use your life-trained platforming skills and navigate the playing field by snatching falling blocks and stacking them to create color-coded matches. With cross-play support and a competitive online mode, it's gonna be a platform delight. Unlock over 100 cosmetics, stack anywhere with robust HD rumble sport, and befriend your grappling hook to the ends of the world. It's coming out this December 2018. And those were the upcoming Switch games for December 2018. If you love this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to become a certified player. That's it. See you next time.